darling, isn't it wonderful to be alone? Oh, it certainly is, honey. And what a relief not to be bothered with those laurels tonight. Now we can have a nice, quiet evening. <laughs> Nothing to mar our happiness. <laughs> oh, Papa! <laughs> Laurels. Well, what did you ask him here for tonight? I didn't ask him here tonight. I haven't seen them for two weeks. Well, you must have. They wouldn't come here uninvited. I tell you, I didn't invite them here. Don't lie to me, you big lunk. Don't you call me a lunk. Why, for two pens, I... Shh. We'll pretend we're not home. Come on, come on. Can't you see they're not home? It's just as well I didn't want to come in the first place. Well, wait a minute. Better leave him a note. You big sap. Who's a sap? Don't call me a sap. You. <laughs> well, 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 well. <laughs> Dear Darling. Oh, I'm so, I'm so glad, glad to see you. Oh, oh do come, come in. in. I was going to call you my name. Sit down. You got... <laughs> I'm so sorry we just finished dinner, but perhaps I could get you something. No, not a thing, thanks. And how about you, Mr. Laurel? Well, I could go for a dish of ice cream. We haven't got any ice cream. Well, you could get some ice cream. Yes, dearie, you can get some ice cream. Get me my new hat, dear, and I'll get some ice cream. Pardon me, please. Yes. You're going to get it in your hat? No, I'm not going to get it in my hat. Go in the kitchen and get me a pitcher. What's that? A pitcher. Never mind, I don't think I want any. You'll have ice cream if it's the last thing I do.
Where'd he go? He went out. Well, we won't be long. Good evening. Good evening, sir. What can I do for you, sir? We'd like a quart of your best ice cream, please. Yes, sir. What flavor? Uh, what flavors have you? Strawberry, pineapple, and vanilla. What flavor do you want? I'll have chocolate. I'm sorry, but we're out of chocolate. Have you any mustachio? No, we're out of mustachio. You're out of mustachio? Yes. He's out of mustachio. Mm-hmm. What other flavor is he out of? Strawberry. We're out of orange, gooseberry, and chocolate. All right, I'll have it without chocolate. Didn't the gentleman just tell you that he didn't have any chocolate? I just told the gentleman I didn't want Just any give chocolate. us a quart of any kind that's handy. Please. Yes, sir. What flavor's that? Chocolate. I just told him I didn't, he didn't have. I'm sorry, but a five's the smallest I have, sir. Thank you. Help me! Help me! Help me! Help me! Help 
Where were you? Saved your life. You've got a lot of nerve butting into other people's affairs. Well, now that you've saved me, you can take care of me. <laughs> I'm sorry, lady, but we've got a couple of wives we've got to take care of. <laughs> Good night. Good night. Just a minute there. Hey, wait a minute. Just a minute. If you make one move, I'll start screaming. I'll tell the world that you pushed me in the water. That you tried to murder me. Oh. Ah! Well, come on, let's go home. I want to get out of these wet clothes. Where do you live? Uh, Over there. Oh, fine. Well, make it snappy. Come on. scare us by screaming. No. No. Go ahead and scream. Police headquarters. Did you get me tell her where to get off? It takes me to handle these dumb dames. <laughs> <laughs> Trying to give me the slip, were you? Why don't you let us alone? Well, for a consideration, I might. Oh, money, huh? I should say not. This has gone far enough. We'll go in and tell our wives just what happened. We'll lay our card right on the table. We'll tell the truth about this woman. We'll come clean. Now you go in and tell them. What, are you, what about you? Ah, uh, he won't go. He's only bluffing. Oh, is that so? Bluffing, huh? Well, I'll show you whether I'm bluffing or not. Ha, 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 ha. Good evening. Where's Stanley? Uh, he's out in the hall. Just a moment. I'll go and get him. <laughs> good night. I mean, uh, goodbye. <laughs> I'll drop your line. I mean, uh, I'll be right back. <laughs> Where is she? I got her in this apartment. Oh, that's my bedroom, you bullhead. I ate it, yes. <laughs> yes, he couldn't wait. <laughs> Say, what about a little uh, hot coffee? Oh, help yourself. We've had ours. Thank you. Sit down, Stanley. <laughs> <laughs>
playing. <laughs> I believe you're going cuckoo. Just because you have the mind of a four-year-old child, you don't need to display it. Remember, we have company. Come, Mrs. Law. <laughs> yes, remember, you have company. <laughs> Go in and keep them entertained while I get rid of this woman. Hey, what'll I say? Oh, tell them a story. Be sure it's funny. Now listen, this has gone far enough. You've got to do something. Oh. Won't you? Oh. That's my wife. Well, what about it? Well, nothing. If you'll just get out of here, please. And don't come back. Oh. Then the farmer came in and he shot the traveling salesman. Oh, how dare you! I'm sorry. What happened? I must have told her the wrong story. Hey, are you sure it's her? Never more sure of anything in my life. Oh! There! That's her, all right! Watch the door! Okay. She's gone. this woman in here. He did. Come down to the station. There's a thousand dollars reward waiting for you. Come on, Kate. Well, that woman has on my coat. Well, how dare you have on my coat? What's the idea? Anyway, take it off. That was a lucky break. What are you going to do with your thousand dollars? I'm going to buy a thousand dollars worth of chocolate ice cream. Where's Stanley? He's gone to the beach. <laughs> <laughs> 